This is a saw that we recommend every installer of the Mr. Manhole system have. It is uh, an ICS saw. It is like a chainsaw with a diamond segmented blade. And you can use this where you get in a situation that maybe you've got granite aggregates in your concrete and you can't cut with the Mr. Manhole cutter so you might be able to score a groove down a couple inches and then take this saw out and plunge cut and go right around that circle and you'll end up with a nice cut. It cuts 16 inches deep. It's running on gas. Uh, we'll show you a couple of the features of the saw itself. But we recommend that you have this along with a water source on your truck at all times. Uh, this one needs water. Uh, they all they all need water, but this one has a water hose which comes with it, valved and brass fittings. Uh, we have a 16 inch bar on this particular model. You can get 14s. We like the 16 better for depth of cut. Uh, diamond chain. Uh, you can also get these in hydraulic powered, which can be run off of your mini excavator or your skid loader with a. Uh, flow reducer. So we recommend that you have eight gallons a minute flow at 20 PSI. 20 PSI and also we recommend that you carry an extra chain. You can't just go down to Walmart and buy those so just have some extra ones. These will really get you out of a pinch when you need, need it. It's invaluable. If you use it, say you run into rebar and you use this to cut, this is cutting about a 3 8 inch wide groove and your Mr. Manhole cutter extractor is going to cut about an inch and a half groove. So you're going to have to make two cuts right where the rebar are and then let your cutter blow the little chunk of rebar that's left in there out of the way. So just remember you can't make one cut where the rebar is and then expect that your cutter is going to, to go right through that. So. Make sure you keep one of these on your truck. They're in the $2,000 range, $2,500. It's a lot of money, but when you need it, it's invaluable. For the ICS saw, it has to have water to cool the blade. You can see this water tank. It's a simple tank that's available at any farm store. You can carry some water with you and a section of hose, and now you can run that saw with the proper coolant. So always have that water with you and have that ICS saw.